Evening, everyone. It's uh, 546, and this is your closing comment for today, Monday the 17th. It is video number 11, uh, 1499. Okay, so the market was very strong today. Uh, Dow closing up 550 and change, up 1.86%. NASDAQ up 354 and change up 3.43. The S&P up just under 95 for 2.65. The Russell uh, up 53 and change for 3.1. And the transports up just under 300, 2.38%. The chart on the screen is the S&P. And um, I want to point this out. It was in my... uh, letter yesterday and my closing uh, my opening comment this morning this market has been very strong it is still a bear market and my biggest concern uh, well this I just find this to be the area of resistance here of supply let's just call it off the high of uh, last week this number 37.72, so somewhere between 37.50 and 3,800, there is plenty of supply. Now, earnings today were okay. Uh, Bank of America was uh, bigger than expected. 29.31 um, 29, uh, was the low just three days ago. Today, it closed at 33.62, up another dollar ninety-two or 6%. Um, I have a problem with today for only one reason, and that is the volume. The volume for a day where we had this kind of a move is absurdly low. Let's remember that it takes much more to push the market up than it does to push it down, because to push it down, all you need is an absence of buyers. And an absence of buyers does not create volume. On the upside, it's more difficult, but the volume in the last couple of days has gone from five and a half billion to today's 3.4 billion, which I find to be dramatically low. Um, In the Dow, we were 29 and one, uh, only um, Walgreens was down and it was only down a quarter of a dollar. But as far as contributing to um, the Dow, the rise, we have the following. We had Microsoft adding 59 Dow points, UNH 58, Goldman Sachs 44, and remember that they um, post earnings tomorrow, I believe, before the open. And we had four stocks all around the same amount, American Express, Salesforce, Home Depot, and J.P. Morgan, all adding about 31 to the Dow. So it was pretty interesting. Uh, Also, uh, the deal that I told you about this morning, which was uh, BP buying LFG at at, uh, 26, what's interesting there is that the stock was 25 and three quarters this morning. At the close tonight, it was 2602, which is actually over the $26 bid. Uh, So it was up 54%, which is about what it was up this morning, but maybe people think there's either going to be an improved bid or somebody else bidding for it. Uh, But uh, that was pretty well uh, implanted in in today's action. Uh, The only news that we got today was the uh, Empire Manufacturing Index, and it it was horrendous. First of all, It's one of those that has a zero line. Positive, even a tenth of a percent, is expansion. Negative, even a tenth of a percent, is contraction. We were down 9.1% versus um, down 1.5% last reading and down 5% for an estimate. So not great. Okay, um, I tried to warn everyone this morning about a stock INPX. Um, This one has been around for a while, and I picked it up off the tape this morning, 
and it has it's one of those um, big reversal uh, stocks I mean uh, reverse uh, split it has reverse split 1 to 30 1 to 40 1 to 45 and about two weeks ago 1 to 75 the stock today closed 911 up 433 or 91% but to give you an idea of what that reverse is it's a dramatic destruction of equity and uh, the stock closing at 911 today versus the adjusted high for all those reverses is about 5 million a share so if you bought one share at 5 million today you had nine dollars and 11 cents left pretty amazing okay uh, as far as um futures oh roblox too sorry uh roblox uh, gave um updated statistics on all of their most important metrics remember the stock was 141 less than a year ago and the low uh, a month or two ago was 2165 for an 84 percent decline however in the last couple of days it's gone from 33 to 43 and the close today was 4263 up 707 or 20 percent um, I bring it up because uh, their metrics, what they use, uh, daily users, in-app purchases, etc., were all wildly bullish, and the stock showed it. Uh, gold was up fifteen dollars at one at sixteen sixty-four, very disappointing, and it was also about fifteen dollars higher. Bitcoin was up four hundred at nineteen five fifteen. The dollar was down a dollar thirty at one eleven ninety. Bonds were lower by about three eighths of a dollar. Nat gas uh, was six dollars, actually fifty nine point nine nine, and that was down about forty five cents. And the silver was eighteen seventy two, and that was up sixty five cents. So, I'm concerned about the volume. Um, and you know i'm just i'm not telling you that it's that the move is over uh, but i am going to rely on the fact that this is still a bear market rally all right everyone have a good evening i'll be back in the morning uh tomorrow morning i think we have um uh i know that we i think we have industrial production and um capacity utilization at 9 15. Have a good evening.